Hello and welcome to RuneScape. So today saw the release of Raids, a uh, much anticipated summer update thing. Um, so to get to Raids, you want to head to Mascab. Mascab is a new world which you find on Tusker. So to get to Tusker, go to the Bandit Camp Lodestone, head north to go to the Bandit Camp, and at the shore there will be a couple of pools which will have the option to swim. You can then swim to Tusker's dead body. Once on there, head to the back, and there's a portal which takes you to Mazcap. Now, just up ahead is where raids take place. Uh, you'll need the grouping system to go into this. You'll want high combat requirements and good gear uh, to stand a chance. You need 10 people, or well, you don't need 10 people, but you can make groups of 10, and that will do it. Just to the right is a uh, Gobi camp. Uh, the gobies are some weird creatures which have rocks on their back and as they get older the rocks get bigger until eventually they get squished which is a bit weird but kind of cool at the same time so there was an item called an artifact which you got from um, meteorites and stuff they've had their names changed to uh, goby relics um, so I've got a bunch of them, I've got 13, some people may have changed them for XP, but you can use them to get reputation. So if I investigate them, uh, XP or bring it to the Gobi Elder, this is to a Gobi Elder, right, a Gobi Elder is one of the ones with the biggest rocks. More. Oh, no, I mind it. It was first option. I found this relic. I can't afford to pay you, but I am willing to. If you are willing to part them, you're indebted. If you hand over relics, you'll gain 65 reputation with the Gobies. Yes. Reputation is a reward system. Um, so the first one get a discount. Next one is banking facilities at the canal area. Fast travel, more discount, title, banking service to the waterfall area. So these two areas are areas within uh, the raids itself so when you're fighting the boss you can't bank but if you have these rewards you can then bank so I've got 65 out of 5,000 reputations so maybe it's not worth it and you could because it's very low um, reputation so maybe I should have just got XP for it um, but yeah uh, next one is a plot of land uh, which is like a house so you can have a player owned house here on Mazcap. Then speed. Then we get a pet. We get a Gobi pet. So we get one of these guys following us around. And then another title. And finally, um, in the combat encounter, you'll get a reroll. So this is like a. D and D sort of like um, war bands, except it's safe PvP. So uh, that's basically Maz Camp. So there's this area here, um, which is one baby camp. I'm gonna go and quickly put on some combat gear in case there's something to fight. Because there will be a couple of mini fighty things. So there's a few things to do apart from raids on here. So I'll quickly just grab melee gear. and I'll head over to the opposite side. So on the other side um, there's a bunch of air route so you can go do your slayer task here and just over here is a forest. Once you enter the forest it's sort of randomly generated sort of like the rooms in Dungeoneering although it's not actually like Dungeoneering so it'll be different each time you go through this forest. Um, so if we enter we'll see what we come across. 
so now we're in the forest. Some of these trees are a bit annoying, a bit in your way. But it's instant, it's like group instant, so other people will be going the same path as you, and it's kind of like a maze. Um, so as you can see some people have got over to that bit if I click there see where it will make me run there's a chest here um, let's see what's in there Occasionally will be creatures to fight, occasionally will be like mini questy things. Search chest, and I got some Dungeoneering XP. Okay then. Oh, and 70 reputation with the Gobi. So that gave me 5 reputation doing that. So it's very low reputation. Um, so imagine the main way to get reputation is uh, through the raids themselves, which, if you're not that combat. Oh, not very good. Oh, let's take a staff. And what can we do with this staff? No idea. Yeah, and if, so eventually, maybe people will get quite good at the raids and have tactics. And the new armor isn't tradable, but the abilities are. Um, so if you want some of the cool abilities that might be quite good um, some there's like a new ultimate and there's like a couple of thresholds and a basics to fill in some of the gaps which is decent so that gave me some some XP give me 6,000 prayer XP, I also got 5,000 farming XP so this is getting me a little bit of reputation um, yeah I really should have used the relics on XP that was a good idea to do that so uh, if you've not already handed them in I would recommend that you uh, use the relics on XP um, so you can get a fair amount of XP in this place though um, from doing various things, clicking on various things in the area. Although there's quite a bit of prayer XP, and I don't need prayer XP, but it's a decent amount. Um, so let's see where we'd go now. I don't really know. I'm not sure whether it just stays like this. Um, I think it does. I think you just come out here again and later in the day you can come back and there'll be a bunch it'll be different so there'll be more things that you can find in the area so I'm gonna finish doing this and then that'll be it so thank you for watching um, I will do a video on me probably dying at raids very quickly um, in a bit and we'll get a look at the first boss and I'll see you again soon bye bye